Hi there, I'm Wayne from drclean.co.uk and today I'm going to show you how to iron a plain skirt. This skirt's a denim skirt with a waistband and two pockets on the front, two pockets on the back, no lining, but it has got a flap at the back. Okay, important with skirts, if you can, and they have pockets, it's quite a good idea to try to iron those pockets uh, to make sure that it's got very small pockets on the dining room side there, and again with the other pocket just, so just make sure they're flat and there's no bulges in them when we come to do them. Um, Okay, the first thing we want to do after that is the waistband. And we're going to go around the waistband. All we're doing is literally the top one inch or two inches of the yarn into the pocket there. Again, around the waistband, just pull the waistband, put it flat, put it down, put it down. You can see both hands are working all the time. Again, to the next section. Pull it flat, pull it flat. Try and make sure that all those creases are actually out. Work on the last section. Be very careful of going over the studs in any dent. It doesn't do an iron any good whatsoever. And the last section, there we go. Now what we're going to do just now is we're going to do the top. What I've done is I've just dragged the lining of the pocket to the work because if I go over the lining of the pocket, what's going to happen is I'm going to create uh, some shine on the surface of the denim, which I don't want. So I'm doing both pockets, I'm just dragging away the lining. Here. And another thing I'll do while I've got the top on is I'm just going to do these pockets. I'm going to do them from the bottom up. You can see I've moved my body to the end of the board to do that. The reason why I'm going upwards is because if I went down, there's a chance that I'd roll fabric and then put a crease in the bottom there. And I don't particularly want that. I want this to be a good arm. And then go from the bottom to the top and just pull that section there so I know the whole top is done really well. You can hear my. Uh, vacuum going. Now, we've already done this skirt down to there and that's where the shaping comes in. If you look there's a shaping to the skirt. So now we've cured part of the problem because that is already really neat and tight. So we've only actually got the bottom to do that. So I've pulled that to, look to get that set. Pull that, pull that. I'm just going to move it on before I do the seams. What I don't want to actually do is I don't want to actually iron the seam itself. The seams underneath, I've made sure it's just moving to the other side. So I'm going to go right up to the seam and not actually iron the seam itself. Now I'm going to just come back on the other side and do exactly the same on the other side of the seam. Right up to the seam, but not actually iron the seam itself. And that makes sure the whole fabric is done but you don't have any shine. Exactly the same on the centre seam here. If I want to, I'll just pull that up, slightly go over the centre seam so I don't shine it. And the next seam, so I've actually got the seam virtually off the iron board there. Straight up and down, straight up and down. Two hands working all the time. I just go again right next to the seam, up and down, and then seam back on to the seam over the other side, then right next to the seam, up and down. We're coming to the final part of the skirt, and it's really best if we match up the, the pleat in the back, the vent in the back, um, so that it actually irons in the right place. If you don't iron it in the right place, if you're putting some tension on here, you'll actually stand a chance of warping it. Yeah? What we want is we want it to sit really nicely. I'm just steaming through there, right on the join. Because once again, I don't want to put too much pressure on here in case I've got any shine. 
there we go. That is the whole skirt done. I don't know if it's got skirt loops or not inside. No, it hasn't. But that is a complete skirt. I can't even put it on. This hanger. Just. There we go. So we have a skirt done, nice back to front, and you'll see the actual vent is laying completely flat, and that's what we want.